Hi everyone, Christopher Cicero here of Roland DGA DG Shape Americas, bringing you Tech Tip Tuesday. Up this week, updates. Are you up to date? Milling machines these days use all kinds of software. There are Windows drivers, machine firmware, control software, CAM software, CAD software, and more. It is important to stay up to date on all of these as it can address bugs, add additional features, and even address hardware concerns. So let's dive right into it, check what versions we are on, and find out how we update and implement those updates. Okay, to check our software versions, we want to open up our V panel for our DWX unit. We want to find the machine settings button on the latest versions. It's the hammer and the wrench on the right hand side here. On older versions, it is the settings column that looks like this circle at the top here. Once in machine settings, we want to go to maintenance in the middle, then to show our report. And in this report, it will show us the versions of the software we are running, uh, as well as a lot more information. We will take that information and go to rollinddga.com, click on the support tab at the top. From there, go to support home. If we have our serial number handy, we can type it in here. Otherwise, we can scroll down to the dental CAD CAM section here. We will look for our machine. If we do not see our machine pictured here, scroll down a little bit further and we can see our older devices there. We will go with the 53DC as our example here. Click on that. And from here, we can see all kinds of helpful information uh, from guides and manuals. Uh, and everything that would come with the machine is found digitally here. Uh, importantly for our updates part here, we can find under drivers, the latest window drivers. Under firmware updates, we can find the latest firmware available for our machine. As we scroll down further, under software updates, we can find updates for the vPanel. Now, also under software updates, we will see links to the websites of our CAM providers. Uh, the first one being here, Sim Systems, will bring you to their website where you can create a, uh, a username and log in and download the latest version, as well as the Hyperdent link will link you to their website uh, where you can also check out the latest versions of the software. And of course, back to the B panel itself, the B panel does have these two uh, arrows here that make the circle that will allow us to automatically check for updates. Thanks for joining me to learn about updates and how you can stay up to date on all your milling related software. Join us again next week for another Tech Tip Tuesday. Until then, we'll see you next Tuesday.